You know something? If Kingdom Hearts 3 actually getting traction, I feel like it's time to play all the Kingdom Hearts games that I haven't played. Namely, 2.8, which is the final chapter prologue. Um, this one. I haven't played this one yet. So these two are the ones that I really want to play, which I really need to play. So I think we should start with this one first. Really? Uh, I guess we're waiting to copy the application data then. I think we're good. I think we're good. We can we can finally play the game. It just took a while to install. We need to see all these again. So is <coughs> so is KH four three gonna run on Unreal four? I'm looking forward to how good this looks because all the trailers of Kingdom Hearts three has it looking like a Pixar film. You know, like when you watch a Pixar film and you think, oh yeah, my game my games could look like this in if I wasn't limited by the the uh, the technology, and now it isn't. It just, it just looks great, especially the, the, uh, the Monsters Inc. world. That looks ridiculously good. Is this the opening or is this the, uh, the menu? It's the opening. Now, now, I don't really remember the ending of Birth by Sleep, but does that mean Aqua saved Terra and Ven? But it can't be right though, because, you know, 
Terra and Vin. Uh, well, Terra is still Xehanort. Alright, anyway. Why would you... Oh. Brightness, evasion, subtitles on. Good. We're good. If that intro plays again. <laughs> Alright, so. Switch targets R2, R1's lock on. Situational commands. Cancel and jump. Confirm. Block. Toggle shortcuts. Alright. I think we're good. I think we're good. I hope we're good. Because I think this is a thing. This is like a preview to things to come of what the game will eventually look like. Terrace Keyblade? Question mark? Why do keys need why do why do weapons need bandages? It's like putting a bandage over a gun. The great battle with Xehanort is almost upon us. As you know, we must take action to keep the seven pure lights safe. And thus, we must hasten to assemble the seven guardians of light. It is time to return to our world the three keyblade wielders we lost over a decade ago. You see, Ventus, I think that this Terra, is in game. Aqua must be saved from their sad end, for they have more to achieve. Following their first battle with Xehanort, Ventus's heart refused to awaken, and so Aqua found a safe location to conceal Ow. him. But when she set off in search of her other missing friend, Terra, she fell to a place from which there is no return without outside help. I saw her in the realm of darkness. Something feels off about Mickey's voice. Oh my god, it is playing again. Is the whole thing going to play again? It is, isn't it? Alright, before you see this. I hope it doesn't skip the regular cutscene as well. Oh, could it be? Wow, this looks good. It is the Dark World, aka the worst Marvel Cinematic Universe film. So, uh, sure. Okay. So I can run, and this moves the camera. And so close to jump. Well, this looks this looks fantastic. Okay. Look at the look at look at the, can we can I manipulate the camera to go like closer to her face? Because this is the kind of face that you see in cutscenes once at one point. Tap to jump, and can press to jump higher. So, 
tapping already gets me right there. So how high is the height? Oh shit, it's higher. Okay. I have no magic, no items. Why is Cinderella's world here in the darkness? <gasps> so Counter attack and using immediately after blocking. Nice, okay. That's right. So this is the roll. Ow. Yay. There's no time in the realm of darkness. I walk on and on without end. In the realm of light, do days or years pass with each step? I know something has started to go wrong. I must hurry. Monologuing. Awesome. Saving. Make our way to the castle of dreams. So I can I can walk. Even the shadow look good. Look, you get you know it's good when like a different light source gives you a shadow. Immersion. Always nice to have. Oh, the control is going nuts. I guess I know which way I'm going. Sometimes a dead end isn't so dead. Try exploring every corner of the map. Your path disappears. Nice, I have a potion. I haven't felt my heart stir in a long time. Something about this place. More, of course. It looks like worse things are stirring. Hey, 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 farewell. Hey, 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 just hoping that Sora doesn't start at like level one in KH3. After all the all the shit team, he's been through. The man deserves to be at least level 70. He beat Sephiroth twice. And yeah, I'm good. I controls pretty easily. Wandering in the dark. I took it for granted. I thought I had nothing in life to lose. P 
PSP graphics. God, you see the improvements, don't you? Here too. Everyone in this world thought that they were safe. Not just the people, but the dog waiting for his owner. The cat curled up in her nook. So much life. Trees and flowers. There's no deeper sadness and discovering all that you knew was gone. The grief in this place is too much to fathom. <sighs> That's enough. I can't keep on wishing for the past. Fulfill specific conditions to complete objectives and you'll be rewarded with clothing and accessories for Aqua's wardrobe. Yeah. Yeah, that's a thing. I have no head. No head. <clears throat> and plain color scheme. Nice. So what are my objectives? Defeat shadows. The test of strength. Master counters. So defeat five heartlesses using the counter blast. And get her to level 60. Hit 20 street lamps. Climb to the highest point and watch the meteor shower. One. Two. Can I? Nope. 20 street lamp. Thanks, easy enough. Oh, she does like a little run after it. See? She speeds up. Three. Four. I don't get any, anything from So just keep hitting the street lamps, I guess. no time in this place, only the clock.
Straight into gameplay. <laughs> 